What's good YouTube? It's your boy I'll be skinny. And today I am here to check out Is this the funniest Funk Master Flex rant ever? Um and it is posted by Hella Clap shit my fault. Hella Classic. So yeah, shout out to Hella Classic. Shit, even before I was doing reaction videos on them, I used to watch their content all the time just to just to like if you want to know anything about damn our history of like rappers beefing and rap like anything. It's so much shit posted on Hella Classic, like, y'all definitely gotta check that out. I'm gonna do multiple reaction videos to they shit. But yeah, let's get into it. It's I-97 Funk Flex. Hot Connecticut, Connecticut, see, I'm... Jersey, New York City, you see me, baby. Tornado man, stay close to that button. I just need you to work the bomb. Okay? Damn. How many bombs getting dropped? New York City, I see everything moving, and I see everybody moving. So let's be clear on this. Oh, I'll be mad. Get me on Twitter right now at Master Flex. Hit me up at FlexWeTrust.com. Hot 97. Oh, is it? Is them bombs supposed to keep dropping? Cause I could have swore he only dropped the bomb like like one or two times, but damn, this shit went like five or six. Com. Listen, we don't discriminate against no one or anybody. <laughs> He's just trying to talk and then this bomb keep going on. Whatever is your preference out here in New York City, we do not discriminate. Because I need to say that before I say what I'm going to say. Does he really do this shit on the air? Like, just drop a whole bunch of bombs? Understand. I mean, I knew he dropped the bombs, but... About my man, Mr. C, not this many. True. Okay? I don't even know who Mr. C is. Let's address that first, but we do not discriminate of what anybody wants to do. All right? That's number one. Hit the bomb. Damn. Now, Nigga, hit the bomb for you. Now, you listen to me right now. <laughs> oh, what? So you understand click. First of all, he hit the bomb before he even told him to hit, hit the bomb. And then he's like, yeah, turn that bomb off. All right? <laughs> After That's he number tells one. Him to hit, hit the bomb. Now turn that bomb off. Now, now turn that bomb off. Listen to me All right, right nigga. now yeah. so you understand clearly. New York City, I'm going to say something today I ain't never said. I know over there in that building. Greasy talk, huh? Let me explain something to you right now. Greasy talk. I'll lose a friendship today. I know everything that moves in that building. Why are you making this so dramatic? <laughs> Did the fucking ball get dropped? You turn the ball off. Yo, I would've, I would've went crazy on my damn engineer or whoever that is. Like, well, I wouldn't have, because he on air, so he can't really, like, Yo, what the fuck you doing, bro? Like, it's only supposed to be right here at this time. Like, he can't really say it, so that's why he just, like, just turned the bomb off. Like, I would have gave him some type of look or eye or something. Like, like, like nigga, what the, what the fuck is you doing? Like, I will fire you on this air right now. Making me look bad. You want to throw a stone this morning? Is that what it is? Huh? I know everything that moves in that building. I know what people like and don't like that are on the mic and off the mic. You sound like you trying to give like a little hood damn horror movie. Turn that bomb off. <laughs> I was about to say, hold on. He said turn the bomb off. It. This nigga's still and dropping you, bombs. All of y'all over there know exactly what I'm talking about. I will <laughs> lose that friendship. <laughs> Cause I stand next to this funny. logo. Hit that bomb. Cause he want the damn bomb off or on. What the I hell? stand next to this logo, and nothing tears it down. Be clear, you'll never win. You can take a pot shot. You dreamt last night that 
that you could get the crown. Hit the bomb. Turn the bomb off. You still did what Yo, you Okay, these are some terrible bombs. For one, the person is dropping them too early. Like, he's like, hit the bomb, but the bomb is already dropped. And then, like, it's like, it just stops. Just because he's like, I'm turning the bomb off. Like, I don't know, could they do some damn, like, fade out on it or something? At least, shit. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck they got going on. You're still in a losing position, but it doesn't stop there for me. Turn that bomb off. Yo, I'll be like, bro, Listen, I told you turn the fucking I know bomb off. goes on in those evenings, and I know what goes on up in that building and around it. And you know the shot I'm sending today. You know what that shot is. You know the gun that I'm loading up to. I hate shit like this. For one, like, he, he on air, he's doing it for his broadcast, radio broadcast or whatever. But if you're going to expose something, put something out, why are you beating around the bush? Why ain't you saying what the fuck is going on over at that place? Like, I ain't heard him say yet what the hell is going on over there. He's just like, because I want to keep, I, I mean, I don't care about no friendship. I, I, he just ain't really, I don't know. Dang, you know what it is. The choice what is, is it? yours. We don't know what it is. Shit, we the, we the yeah, listeners. You know what it is, and you know what I'm saying. And everybody standing next to you, your menses and your friends, they know what it is too. And they know who I'm talking about. And they know the two people I'm talking about over there. See, yeah, this definitely on some house. You want to go, you make sure you're ready to go. You make sure you're ready to move. That's one thing. Number two, you will always, always dream of winning. You will never win. You can take anything that you see, anything that you want to go with. This building does not crumble. You'll never take it. it won't Hold on, did he say? It's in the armor, baby. Win. You will always, always dream of winning. You will never win. Oh, you okay. He talking about like his oppositions, I guess. He's saying they're going to dream of winning, but they ain't never going to win. Take anything that you see, anything that you want to go with, this building does not crumble. You'll never take it. It won't happen. It's in the armor, baby. You can't break it. You can't change it. It is what it is. It's not my fault. You can't get hot. This radio thing, I'm built for it. Unfortunately, you're not. Um, I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna say that he's not built for radio like he has a good voice uh, and he's been putting in the damn work like I'm, I ain't got nothing against Funkmaster Flex like I see he was talking down on the Tupac movie and saying Tupac was this and Tupac I don't know I see him say a lot of a lot of ho shit like just him even doing this, like, the two people that he's talking about, he could have went over there or spoke to them personally, like, yeah, I know what's up with y'all niggas, like, I ain't work, blah, 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 instead of getting on the radio, talking subliminal, subliminally, making all of us, like, chime in to a thing, like, oh, damn, like, what the fuck is really going on? And this was damn 2012, and this is 2017 now. That was five years ago, and I still don't know what the fuck was going on and still don't know who the fuck Mr. C is. So, you know, that's why he shouldn't be really, like, subliminal with shit if you're gonna put it out. Like, you might as well let motherfuckers know what's good if you're gonna put it out. But, uh, I thought it was a funny a funny rant. Um, I, I don't know what his other big rant was. I think he had one with, like, 50 Cent or something. Something. But, uh, let me know what y'all think about this. Yeah, definitely. Let me know what y'all think, man. Uh, Till next time, YouTube. I'm out. Strongest on the media. Bitch, do you wanna ride? Do you? Do you wanna get inside? Bitch, ass or gas? Ass or gas?